There you go, Orange. Thanks, Raspberry. It's perfect. But I still don't understand what it's for. This! <laughs> standing on each other's shoulders rule. I know what it needs. No match for two birds. Orange, what do you call it? Uh, I don't know. It's a ball stuffed with dandelion fluff. So how about we call it Dandy Ball? <gasps> yes, Dandy Ball. <laughs> Great. <laughs> Outside. Well, what do you mean? <laughs> oh. <laughs> I can't imagine a more perfect day for a needle pointing picnic. <laughs> Pointing today? Well, we got so caught up in the excitement of Dandy Ball. So, we thought maybe we'd finish our picnic in here. <laughs> so, you know, we won't get distracted. 
Hi, Plum. Hi, Strawberry. I was wondering if I could ask a favor. Of course. What do you need? I need some help clearing part of the meadow. Sure. I'd be glad to help. <gasps> so, what are we clearing this for, Plum? So I'll have space to use for my dance recital. Wait a minute. I thought the dance recital was going to be near the gazebo. It was. But with Dandy Ball being so popular, I thought it'd be easier to just move. Hmm. There's plenty of room outside for everyone. Dandy Ball shouldn't be getting in anybody's way. And there should be plenty of room to play Dandy Ball, too. Right! Everyone should be able to enjoy themselves and the outdoors with just a bit of planning. Oh, oh yeah, yes, of course! Yes, yes, yes. Good idea! So, who should do the planning? I'd volunteer, but I have to finish the costumes for Plum's recital first. That's right! Hmm. And I need to practice. Who would be good? Well, since I was the one who sort of got the ball rolling... Make that floating. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I should be the one to figure out a way to keep things fair for everybody. Maybe I could figure out, oh, I don't know, some sort of schedule. Oh, what about Lemon? Me? <laughs> yeah! You schedule appointments all day, and the problem here seems to be all about scheduling. Huh. I guess it is about scheduling. Okay, I'll give it a try. Is that okay with you, Orange? You did volunteer first. Oh, no problem. I think Raspberry's right. Lemon will do a really good job. Besides, I'm pretty busy with my store right now. And with the new game, I've kind of gotten behind. I'll see you later. Okay, Orange. See you later. Once upon a time, there was a big baby berrykin who loved to do somersaults. Mmm, I love that story. What's going on? How come everyone is just standing around? We're waiting for Blueberry Zara to be up so we can play again. Oh, where is Blueberry? Oh, she finished a while ago and went back to her store. So why don't you just go ahead and play? Lemon schedule says we can't until Blueberry's hour is up. But that doesn't make... This doesn't seem quite right. Hi, everyone. Oh, hi, Strawberry. Hey, hi, Strawberry. Strawberry. Is Lemon around? <gasps> Hi, Lemon. How's it going? Oh, fine, fine. Almost got this worked out, I think. One hour for watering plants, one for tasting jam. You know, Lemon, maybe an hour is too long for some activities and too short for some others. Huh? What do you mean? Well, I didn't need a whole hour to read to the Berrykins. And the Berrykins needed more than an hour to play dandy ball. Gee, I hadn't thought of it that way. I'm used to making salon appointments by the hour. I know I can figure this out, but it's taking forever. I don't have any time to do my hair appointments. Maybe someone else could take over while I get caught up? Well, I'm pretty busy, but I suppose... Oh, oh, you know who'd be good at this? Blueberry! Plum's right! Me? Well, yeah, now that I think about it. Research, detail, figuring out numbers. Those are things you're really good at. Well, I do enjoy those things. Okay, I'll do my very best. Oh, thank you. This is great. Here, I'll help you move all the papers. Are you okay with 
with Blueberry taking over the scheduling? Oh, sure. It's the kind of thing she's good at. She's bound to figure out what's best for everyone. Ooh, I still have lots to do in the store. Better get back to it. Bye. Bye, Orange. The longitudinal lines have days of the week. Rectangles represent dandy ball. Here's quilting a square. Story time for the baby barricans is a hexagon. Plum's dance recitals are circles. The book fair, two squares. Well, now that takes care of 9 o'clock Tuesday morning. Now on to Wednesday. Uh, hang on. This is Monday. Uh, hang on. Uh, <laughs> well, um, that concludes the presentation portion of my, um, presentation. But I made a copy of everyone's schedules in handy pocket size, so you can always carry it around. Here you go. This is for you. Here's yours. Uh, here you are. Here you go. This is yours. One for you and one for you. And well, this is really great, Blueberry. Lots of, um, details. And so thorough. But I don't mind telling you, figuring this out was a bit more complicated than I thought. I'm sure it'll work out just fine once everyone gets the hang of it. <gasps> What's going on? It's supposed to be my turn for the book fair. I thought I got to have my gymnastics class now. But they all think they get to do their activities now. Uh, uh, my turn! Not fair! It says right here that... I checked twice. I know it's my turn. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, hang on. I'll be right back. Okay, uh, it's here somewhere. <laughs> That's not it. Aha! The outdoors gets used now for... Jadybug's surprise birthday party. My birthday isn't for two more months. Wait, what surprise party? I know it's here. I just saw it. I'm sorry, everyone. Listen, we all like dandy ball, right? So for now, let's all play. And I'll try to figure out a better schedule. <laughs> Why not? Okay, dokey. Might as well. <laughs> Lovely idea. Yeah, yeah, right, 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 right. 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 Wow, this was trickier than I thought. I think I can straighten out the rest of the day. But maybe one of you could give it a try after that. How about you, Raspberry? Oh, well, I'd be happy to try, but I think the perfect person is... You, Strawberry! After all, you schedule activities in the cafe. Maybe, but I wonder if Orange shouldn't give it a try first. <laughs> Orange? Sure. Why not? Oh, no, 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 no. It's not that we don't think she can do it. Oh, no. I mean, she's great at thinking fast. Excellent. But sometimes she kind of... Uh, jumps into things? Yeah. And she's never had to do this kind of planning before. None of us have had to do this kind of planning before. I think if we give Orange a chance, she'll surprise everyone, including herself. Hey everyone! What's going on? Well, Strawberry had this idea. And we wanted to know what you think of it. Her idea is that maybe you should try to organize the outdoor areas. I don't know if I would be good at that kind of thing. Planning, organizing, scheduling. And I really do have a lot of work in the store right now. What work do you have to do, Orange? Well, I have to keep track of what people have bought so that I know what I have to reorder. I have to figure out where to put everything I've ordered once it comes in. And I have to put everything in its special place on the shelf so that everyone can find what they're looking for. Then I have to do my weekly calendar, you know, where I schedule which days I clean the store, which days I stock the shelves. Sounds like a lot of planning, organizing, and scheduling. Oh, it is. That's why I don't have much time to... What are you all smiling about? Because 
everything you just said is about planning and organizing and scheduling. Exactly the kind of planning, organizing, and scheduling the community areas need. And I should know. Oh, hi, everyone. Oh, this seemed like a pretty big job at first. But I realized it was just like working in my store. I had to start with one activity, then move on to the others. But why didn't I think of that? So I broke it into smaller jobs, and the first job was to organize the game of Dandy Ball. Of course, that makes so much sense. So, I set up six teams. Everyone can sign up to be on a team over there. I'm gonna be on the orange team, naturally. <laughs> I figured out how long it usually takes to play one game then added how many games we have to play a week to finish a month-long season. So, Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays are dandy ball days. I worked out the whole season. There's even a championship! Oh, yay! <laughs> Once I had the game figured out, I was able to fit everything else into the rest of the week. <laughs> yes! Here's Raspberry's fashion show. Oh, that's perfect! Two hours is just the right amount of time I need to set up. And these are perfect times for story reading. The baby bearkins are awake. All my gymnastics classes are scheduled for when the breeze is nice and cool. And here are the smaller versions of the schedule. Wow, Orange, it looks like you thought of everything. We wish we could have been more helpful. You can be. There are a few things we could still use. Oh, hey! Those teams will need uniforms. I can definitely design them. And Dandy Ball should have a rule book. I've always wanted to write an official rule book. Oh, the team should have someone to cheer them on. I'll go work up some cheerleading routines. Oh, wow, Orange. I'm so sorry we ever questioned whether you could do this. I questioned it, too. It was Strawberry who got me to realize I could do it. The only way to find out what you can do well is to give it a try. Or to find out what you don't do so well. Orange, wait up! Oh, you were amazing! I'm just glad I could help. That's why I wanted to talk to you. Maybe you could help me reorganize the post office. Sure, Jadybug. I'd be glad to. Orange, I need to ask a favor. Certainly, Princess. What can I do for you? I wonder if you could help get the Berry Works to run a bit more smoothly. I'll certainly give it a try. Right after I help Jadybug with the post office. There you are. I've been trying to come up with a better way to sort all the books in my store. Maybe you could... Help you organize? Sure. Right after I help Jeannie Bug and Princess Berry. <laughs> I mean, right after one more game of Dandy Ball! Come on! Thanks for asking. Yes, we do. <laughs> then dig in. What was that? Oh, is it the Fairy King Marching Band practice season already? No, that's not for another month. What? 
Let's go find out. Oh, yeah, 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 we gotta see what this is. What is it? Very exciting. What's going on? To a beg your pardon. Oh no, I beg you. No, 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 no. After you. No, after you. No, 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 you first. No, 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 no. I insist. First. One ladybug you, argument you, coming you, up. You. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't we say it together? What a wonderful idea, ladybug. We're starting a new club, and we want you to join. Club? Run by Sadie Bug and Katie Bug? But they're always arguing. How much fun could that club be? Unless it's a debate club. Behold! Our, Our good, good citizens club! See? We even have membership pins. A good citizens club? Really? They do seem to be getting along. Maybe they've turned over a new leaf. Make it a whole tree. Pardon me, but what exactly does a good citizens club do? What exactly is a citizen? A member of the community. So a good citizen is... A kind and helpful member of the community. Uh, yeah! <laughs> and good citizens do... Good citizens eat things. Like bringing soup to sick berry kids? Donating old clothes to the needy. Keeping very bitty city clean? Uh, sure. <laughs> and if you do something really good, Citizen Z, you get membership pins. See? Ooh, a membership pin. And we even have a motto. Oh, what is it? Happy to serve others. Oh, oh wow, well, that's, that's just really great. Nice. Right. 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 <laughs> so, what's next? Do we do helpful things for the community and its citizens? You got it! Just do as many of those things as you can before our first meeting tomorrow evening at the Good Citizens Clubhouse! And then we can talk about uh, those uh, good citizens-y things that we all did! And think up some new ones, too? Definitely! Sure thing! Why not? Yay! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, wait, wait, wait! Last minute special delivery! Super duper really important highly special good citizens club first meeting reminders! Sorry, my fault. No, 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 my fault. Not mine. Please make sure you deliver all of them before tomorrow. I was thinking I might bring some snacks or something to the meeting tonight. Do you have any crackers? Hi, Plum. Sure, I'll get them. Wow, Orange. Pretty. Oh, isn't it? My Good Citizens Club membership pin. It came in the mail. Where's yours? Um, my mail hasn't come yet. a whole new fashion statement to go along with my Good Citizens Club membership pin. Wow! That's a very creative idea, Raspberry. I love it. Nice outfit, Raspberry. Oh, wow! Oh, you look great! Oh, yes, fantastic! I have to go check my mailbox. I can't wait to see my pin. <gasps> I didn't get one! Why didn't I get one? How am I supposed to go to the meeting tonight without a membership pin? I don't understand. Well, I'll just have to ask the ladybugs what happened. Maybe she went to do a good citizen thing by herself. Well, I'm sure she'd like to join us. It's way more fun to work together. Let's leave her a note on the door. We'll tell her that we're over at the Berry Grove helping the Berrykins dig a new path for a stream so that it will go around the grove instead of right through it. Very good idea. Over here! No, over here! It'll be way oh, better here! Oh, good! You're here! It'll be way better here! No, here! <clears throat> no, here! Excuse me. Oh, Plum! We were having 
a um, discussion about where to put the banner. Where, where would you put it? it? Uh, right in the middle? Excuse me, but the other girls have Good Citizens Club membership pins. And I'm just wondering what I need to do to get mine. Is there some sort of test or something I have to pass to show I can serve others? Uh, Plum, would you mind giving us some privacy for a moment so we can have a, um... A, um, hmm, club leaders conference. Of course. I'll be just right outside ready for my test. You forgot to send her pin. Did not. Must have been you. You're always forgetting something. Nuh-uh. Yeah, huh? Uh, yeah, huh? What are we going to do? We can't lose her as a member of our club. I guess we'd better give her a test like she wants. Oh, uh, right. But we don't have a good citizens club test to give. Well, she said she wants a test on serving others. Oh, Plum! Ready to show I can be a good citizen. Do you want to be in the good citizens club? Yes. I can't hear you. Yes. I still can't hear you. Yes. You must take the test of good citizenness. Whatever it is, I'll do my very best. Yes, yes, yes. So, your first test will be to paint the clubhouse inside and out so it looks nice before the first meeting of the Good Citizens Club. Inside and out? <sighs> uh, is that too hard? Because instead you could... Absolutely not too hard for me. I am happy to do my best to make the Good Citizens Club look fabulous for everyone. Oh, no, 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 no. Start on that side. You're blocking my tan over there. <laughs> I don't know. I think that blue clashes with my eyes. Can you do a lighter shade? What's that? Here, give me the paintbrush. That's more like it. That looks like a rabbit. It looks like a flower. It doesn't. Does too. It doesn't. Does too. It doesn't. <sighs> Exactly the way we wanted it! Are you sure you think it's not good? Should you do it over? No, no, it looks terrific, really. Let's wait to get the other member's opinion before we go changing anything. So is that it? Do I get my pin now? Well, uh, you finished the first test. Congratulations! First test? How many are there? Uh, a three. Yeah, three skirts. Yeah, we always use three. Uh huh, three. Oh. <sighs> I wonder where Plum is. Yeah, she's missing all the mud. I'm sorry, but I have to ask. Just what exactly does this have to do with being a good citizen? Well, all that painting made me hungry. And all that painting made me thirsty. And obviously, we need snacks and drinks for tonight's meeting, right? Yes. I actually have some crackers I was going to bring. That's it. We'll need a lot more than just crackers. And drinks, too. And we need to sample the snacks and drinks first, of course. But what does snack tasting have to do with good citizenship? It's, um, making sure it's good. For the citizens, of course. Are you sure? Absolutely. <laughs> Happy, Happy to, to serve others! I can make peanut butter and glimmerberry sandwich surprises. Blueberry and lemon will like those. And kiwi smoothies. Hmm. Dear Plum, when you're finished, we are over at the Berry Grove helping the Berrykins dig a new path for a stream. 
Oh, no! The other girls are already doing good deeds for the community. I'm so behind. I've got to hurry. keeping her busy all day. I know. Let's leave her another note. Sorry we missed you at the Fairy Grove. I'm sure you've been very busy being a good citizen. See you at the meeting. Love us. Ew! You call this a snack? How about this one? Oh. <laughs> But the snacks aren't just for you. I thought this was about the other club members, too. Uh, oh. Well, okay. These'll do. Time to move on to test number three. Number three? You're only one test away from your membership pin. Well, okay. But this is the last one. Just give us a sec to have another club leaders conference. <laughs> in the community garden is a great project for the Good Citizens Club. And I have all the right things to do it with. And I have just the right design for it, too. This is gonna be great. Plum will love it, too. She loves planting flowers. I wish I knew what she was doing all day. It's almost time for the club meeting. She definitely wouldn't miss the first meeting. She came by this morning and picked up some crackers for all of us. That's so nice of her. Let's go by and pick her up. Well, did you decide yet? What's my final test? Uh, this place could use a little color, but I already painted it. Pink, like you wanted. What she means is color and fragrance. So, cut some flowers from the community garden to decorate the clubhouse with. How about I gather some flowers from the forest? But the prettiest flowers are in the community garden. You aren't supposed to pick flowers from the community garden. Those flowers are for everyone to enjoy in the garden, not for us to take home for ourselves. I'll pick some flowers from the meadow. My favorite ones are in the community garden. But community service isn't about what your favorites are. Don't you understand? If everyone picked those flowers for themselves, soon there wouldn't be any left. And no one in Berry Bitty City would be able to enjoy them anymore. Uh, we could enjoy them. We thought you wanted to serve others. Others like us. We thought you wanted to be a good citizen like everyone else in the club. <laughs> well, are you going to pick those flowers? No. Saying no is simply unheard of in the Good Citizens Club. Then I guess I can't be in your club. <laughs> I can't be in our club? But, but you, you have to be! I'm sure you've been busy being a good citizen. Good to see you again. Where have you been all day, fellow good citizen? Bet you've been doing good citizenly things. <laughs> Gee, was it something I said? Something certainly not right. Plum? <laughs> What's wrong, Plum? Tell us. We're your friends. I'm not a good citizen. What? But Plum, you're one of the very, very best citizens I know. I... I 
didn't pass the test that you all passed. So, I'm not in the club. Test? What test? I didn't take any test. I didn't take a test. Did you? Nope, not me. I don't think anyone did. What are you talking about, Plum? The ladybugs didn't give you tests? Then how come you all have membership pins and I don't? Didn't yours come in the mail? I don't know what's going on, but I think it's time for us to have a good citizen word with the ladybugs. That one. No. That one. You call that a flower? Now that's a flower. <laughs> and like, you would know. Are you saying I can't pick a flower? I am saying that you couldn't pick a flower to pick if the flower picked you! Uh, excuse me. Oh. <laughs> Early for the meeting, are we? We're here to find out why you gave Plum a good citizen's test, and not any of us. Um, sorry. Uh, we can give you girls tests too if you want. Why would any of us have to take a test at all? Especially Plum. Plum is always a good citizen. You weren't going to cut the community flowers, were you? Um, well, yeah, because Plum wouldn't, so we have to. Plum wouldn't? No. It was her final test. But she said no. <laughs> Can you believe it? Uh, excuse me. How come I never got a good Citizens Club membership pin, but everyone else did? We don't know why you never got it. We, um, mailed your pin out with the others. But, but what about the tests? We sort of, kind of got the idea from you. Me? Well, you seemed like you really wanted to take one, so... Because I thought all my friends had. You don't have a clue about what makes a good citizen, do you? <laughs> Why did you start this club anyway? Well, um, so we could be in a club. And be, you know, really popular. And be the leaders. Like the bosses of the club? No one's ever wanted us in a club before. I guess now we know why we're not very good citizens. Sadie Bug, oh, Katie Bug. I think your idea for a good citizens club is a great idea. You do? But you definitely didn't follow your own club's mission. Happy to serve others. You have to be the ones to serve others, not others serving you. We're so sorry for not acting like good citizens. And we promise we'll do better from now on. Strawberry, will you take over as club leader? I'm glad to see you've learned your lesson, but hmm, I know someone who has already proven she'd make a perfect club leader. Cutting the community flowers and taking them for yourselves isn't being a good citizen. But saying no to something you feel is not good for the community was a brave and very good citizen-y thing to do, Plum. idea that the club do something good for the entire community by planting more flowers in the community garden. And after that, we can spruce up the town gazebo. And maybe some warm scarves for the Americans for the winter. A stylish ones, of course. And we can, um, um, um... Oh, 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 oh! We eat snacks! <laughs> make snacks for the berry kids and the berry works. Yeah, because they all work so hard. I think that's a lot of good ideas for our club to do. I call for a vote. All in favor? Aye. The ayes have it. Aye. And now I officially declare that at the close of our first meeting of the Good Citizens Club, we should 